Jared Jabosa has more on this fascinating angle for us. In today's Tech Check, I had not yeah, Kelly. considered this, Deirdre. <laughs> Right, because all eyes are on generative AI and Llama and the open source model, but its core is still that advertising revenue. So let me put this all together. First, take a look at shares of Timu Parent PDD over the last month, down some 30%, massively underperforming its Chinese peers. The key difference between PDD and the rest of these names is advertising dollars going directly to our biggest digital ad companies, Meta and Alphabet. According to the journal, Timu was Meta's top advertiser by revenue in 2023 and a top five ad spender over at Google that year. New data from Barclays on thousands of Timu spenders points to more weakness, new buyer activations well off of its peak and back at early 2023 levels. This chart showing that the number of new shoppers is nearly half of what it was less than a year ago. And this comes on top of another potentially negative catalyst, a White House plan to restrict the use of a trade exemption that has helped these Chinese e-commerce apps like Timu and Xi'an, by the way, ship packages to U.S. consumers duty free. It's how they become so popular here. But pain for Timu and Xi'an, Xi'an's private, could translate into pain for Meta and Google, where they've been spending billions of dollars in advertising to reach the American consumer. Meta's valuation, I want to point out, has soared over the last few months. Shares, as you mentioned, hitting another record high today. Its forward PE multiples now sitting at 24 times earnings. In late July, it was just holding on to 20 times forward earnings. So, Kelly, it could be a vulnerable point. You could argue that Meta is now priced for perfection. Everyone is excited about generative AI. That's going to take time to trickle through. For now, though, its main profit engine, revenue engine, advertising, that could be soft if Timu and Sheehan continue to feel some pain. I did not realize they were one of the biggest or the biggest advertiser. So uh, it's going to take some time to replace that void. So, Deirdre, thanks for bringing that to us. Deirdre Bosa in Tech Check.